Colorado calls it one of the most significant gun regulations in decades. The Biden administration says they are confident the rule will save lives. Terrence is back to explain what's changing. Yeah, let's break it all down. If you sell guns predominantly to earn a profit, you must be licensed and you must conduct background checks. The White House says this rule will close the so-called gun show loophole. That loophole allows people to sell firearms at gun shows, flea markets, and online without checking the buyer's background. Then those guns wind up in the hands of people who aren't allowed to have them. Now, this is all happening because Congress passed the Bipartisan Safer Communities Act of 2022 last year. State Representative Bob Morgan says Illinois has already adapted a universal background check system, but this rule will make Chicago and surrounding suburbs even safer. Well, we've seen for years that a lot of the firearms and the guns that we're finding uh, that are being used illegally and for the commission of crimes in Chicago are coming from other states, primarily Indiana and Missouri. One of the reasons they're coming from those states is because they have much less stringent restrictions and regulations around who has access to a gun and how many guns. There may be challenges to this new rule in court. The NRA says background checks don't stop criminals from getting guns. But the Biden administration is confident the regulation will hold up. It's expected to go into effect in about 30 days.